Good day to everyone. I'm Mad Wantamad and welcome to our video here at Madodal Channel. For today's video, we are going to show you our 8 grow bed aquaponic system here in the rooftop somewhere in Pateros. So let's go through the system as we walk through our system parts. So follow me. So here we have our rooftop. You will see the view here. We are on the fourth floor. So let's look at the river outside. So that's the Pateros River and the view of SM and Makati over there. So let's now walk through our system. This is a protected net house with a fine mesh net and a polycarbonate rooftop and a shade for our fish tank. So let's enter our protected shelter. Follow me. So to start our system walkthrough, this is our 1,200 liter conical bottom fish tank. So the fish tank has 100 red tilapia in it. So that is the inlet from the pump and we have aeration to provide dissolved oxygen and this is a solid lifting outlet that sucks in fish waste from the bottom of our fish tank and delivers it to our floating raft over or to our Dura flow radial flow filter over here. So this is the Dura flow filter. The central part is a radial flow filter and it goes to a static bed filter or a static media filter and then it flows to another radial flow filter and then it goes to our MBBR or moving bed bioreactor. So this is our moving bed bioreactor. We have uh, moving media pellets that converts the ammonia from our fish waste into usable nitrates for our plants. So it overflows in an overflow over here. So this is the overflow. And then it goes to our gravel bed. So the inlet of the gravel bed is over here. So you can adjust the flow here by this valve. And then it exits a bell siphon over here. So this is the bell of our bell siphon. So this is a very basic device. And then that is the standpipe. So the standpipe determines the level of the water here in our gravel bed. So after the gravel bed, it exits to our floating raft over here. So let's look at the floating raft. So this is the exit of our bell siphon. It exits to this floating raft. It has a mirror image on the other side. So we have uh, the same bell siphon with the inlet on the corner and then the bell here in this corner and it exits to this floating raft over here. Okay? And then part of the exit from the filter exits here. So it also provides aeration as the filter exits this floating raft or DWC. We also have additional aeration by this, uh, the use of air stones. So that's additional aeration. The air stones we use are plastic so they're very easy to maintain and clean when they get clogged. So that's it. That's how easy it is to clean our air stone. So each uh, DWC has 110 net pots. So the net pot has pumice and it's submerged here in the grow bed or the floating half grow bed. So these are all just styrofoam, uh, net pots on styrofoam and floating on water, okay? Then the grow beds 
the floating raft row beds then flows to the next row bed over here, and then this one flows to the next row bed, and then and then it exits to our pump over here. Okay, so this is just a very small pump. So as you can see, this is a very small pump. The pump delivers the water back to our fish tank over there. So let's go to the fish tank. So this is the inlet of our fish tank from the pump. And then the cycle continues back to our solid lifting outlet and then back to our radio flow filter. So we also have sensors over here which monitors the temperature, the TDS, and the pH of our system. So the TDS is 98 uh, parts per million, the pH is 8.25, and then the temperature is 34 degrees Celsius. And then we also have a compressor which provides air for our fish tank, our radio flow filter, and our DWC wraps. So again, if you have questions on aquaponics, don't forget to like, share, subscribe to the to my daughter channel. And we also have uh, monthly webinars, which we will post uh, our schedules on our Facebook page, Modular Aquaponics. Again, thank you for watching.